Hey everyone, welcome to today's day trading update, Thursday, December 10th. Uh, beautiful green day today, plus 923. Uh, had only one loser in Adobe for minus 295. Uh, small winner in Baba, 63. Nice winner in Beyond for 464. That was my biggest winner. Uh, Facebook, 81. Microsoft, plus 420, my second biggest winner. Piton, plus 90, and Roku, plus 100. So let's go over these. Starting with, let's start with my loser, Lahu Zahur, Adobe. So the logic on the Adobe trade was they just announced earnings, uh, started off weak, and then came all the way back up to the highs of the day. I was looking at it here, did not get in, made another push. When it came back down, uh, when it came back down, I was looking for it to hold positive and make another push higher, and it just flushed out, went negative. So I just cut cut losses pretty quick there. Uh, in Baba. Let's go to Baba, Alibaba. So in Baba, um, we did a we did a mighty 90 trade here. So we uh, had that initial push up, got short up here, and just caught uh, this down move. Got out of half and then was looking for a little bit more. It started to bounce, so I just bailed on the rest. So then he ended up just booking a small winner of 63 bucks. Uh, beyond my biggest winner, plus 464. Uh, so beyond. Kind of the uh, similar thing that happened in Adobe, except for this one worked out for us. Uh, had this initial push lower, came all the way back up to positive, started consolidating right near the highs of the day. We got long. Um, I got long right here, and then I added a little bit as it pulled down to, to yesterday's low, this yellow line, and then boom, it exploded higher. Uh, we held our last piece until this bar right here, uh, which was a good exit because it started to come down. Uh, so we were done by, let's see, it's 11. Yeah, we were done by 11, 11 a.m. Central Time. Uh, Facebook plus 81. So what did we do in Facebook? Let's see here. Oh, yeah, Facebook. So we, um, so this was an inter this isn't a typical price action type trade that we took, but it's a, it's a version of a, of a runner. Uh, Facebook made this initial push up, just could not go positive on the day, made, made a few different attempts and came down. Meanwhile, the the rest of the tech stocks, uh, including the indices, the NASDAQ and S&P, were still going higher, and, and Facebook just started getting weak. Uh, and so I was looking for a point of entry, and when it made this bounce, we got short right here and just rode this thing down, got out of half down here. I was looking for another push over, and it just started pushing up. I didn't want to give up my P&L, which is... So I ended up just closing out right here, which was a good exit because it ended up pushing up even higher. Uh, so just booked a small winner in Facebook of 81. Uh, Microsoft, my second biggest winner, plus 420. Um, so what we did in Microsoft is, uh, as this thing made this initial push up, got the spike in volume up to this pivot, we got short and just caught a little bit of this down move here. We were using really short duration options, just the one day to expiration options today, and those things are super super sensitive to the uh, to the price of the stock. And so you can see just a little move there it was a really nice P&L. Of course, it works both ways. If it pushes against you, it's gonna move move against you quickly as well. Uh, Piton, booked 90 bucks in Piton. And in Piton here, we were very patient. I mean, this thing just kept pushing, 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 pushing. Finally, when it made this push here, uh, we took a short, had a little higher volume, uh, and just caught this little pullback to the pivot here, just took a small profit out of it. I talked about you know potentially getting long for an upside runner here as it started to kind of pull back to this pivot. Didn't pull the trigger because I was, I was working on another trade. Uh, it would have been a, a really nice winner to the upside, but shoulda, coulda, woulda. Still booked a P, uh, green P&L and Piton. And then Roku. Uh, booked a hundred bucks in Roku, and with this uh, made this big push up. Uh, Roku's you know just made new all-time highs yesterday, so we we're looking to get long as it pulled back right here, got long, and got out of half of it as it made this push up, and then it pulled back down as the market started to flush lower, uh, and then at this point is when I was just done for the day right at 11 a.m. made this little bounce up and I just closed the rest out so didn't want to didn't want to take a loss it ended up bouncing a little bit more so I could have could have made a little bit more but still plus 100 in Roku so plus 923 for the day uh, good day of trading if you guys have any questions let me know